when you're going to do dorky stuff. So give you a little bit of a rundown of what we're doing this weekend. We had our good friend Tyler up this morning, our building consultant. I've decided to give him a title. He is our building consultant. <laughs> He came up and he got us all squared away. Our bracing is good to go. He got our door bucks, I believe. <laughs> That's what they're called, in place for pouring concrete tomorrow morning. We're just kind of working around trying to get things cleaned up so that that cement truck, we're gonna use our same friend, Dwayne McLaughlin, um, to, to be able to get around the pad, of course, to pour concrete. But we're we're pretty much good to go to to pour concrete. Okay, then you're on YouTube. All right, let's go. Here we are. Building <laughs> the house. Let's go. Who's this wild animal right here? I don't know who that was. I don't know. <laughs> oh man. So we met Aiden. We dis we discovered today was about what four years ago. Yeah, it's five, five years ago. Years ago yeah, so Aiden is the neighbor's nephew. And about four or five years ago, he came up, him, his mom, and his sister came up for a little vacation, stayed down at his nephew's, his uncle's place, sorry. And him and Dylan, our youngest, hung out along with some other neighbor boys all, well, you guys were up here for a week, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. Pretty much the whole entire week. We went huckleberrying, they oh, rode yeah. motorcycles, they rode four-wheelers. Yeah. Anyway, Aiden's been back and forth a couple times ever since, and he has spent the summer um, up here with his uncle. And so, yeah, we, we brought him along. We brought him into the fold to help us with this project. <laughs> he doesn't know what he's in for. Yeah. So here for the doors, I believe these are called door bucks. So basically the whole idea is that when you pour the concrete in, it just does not come out from pouring the concrete in from where we had it cut out for the doors. And then we just let the concrete kind of overflow over the bottom part of the door here, from what I understand. So he's got he's got our doors prepared on every one. So we're good to go there. Our expansion gaps. He's got we've got plywood on both sides of the the expansion gaps or OSB board. So that the expansion gap will just, of course, give it room to, to do its thing. Right there, right there. Oh, yeah. There's plastic cut in there. Oh, okay. So that's what we're, that's what we're shooting for. Oh, I bet. Nope. Yeah, good. So on the Fox blocks, everywhere it says Fox blocks, there's a plastic clip in, that's good. in there. So, like this web here, you can see our rebar in there, and this is a clip, the clips that hold the two fox blocks together, and... You know our dose uh, screws. What's that? You know our dose, or the screws. Uh, dose. Two? Okay. Should I do the bottom one? Yes, please. Because they're not, they're not really tough. It's not like going. Yeah, wood, so wood. are these staying here the yep. whole time? So yep. they're here forever? No. They oh no. After we pour the concrete tomorrow, really? And everything when we strip all this stuff, this all comes off. What about these guys? Yeah. These big poles. How do you yep. get those out? You can grab a hold of them with your big meaty hands and pull them out. I can't use my feet. No. Man, okay. I was looking forward to doing that. Okay. <laughs> and there are no well. I have flip-flops, but I'm not working technically. Yeah, there I mean, are no flip-flops yeah, on the work flip -flops. site yeah, today. Oh yeah, I should work on this tomorrow. We were giving AJ a bad time about wearing flip-flops the other night. Oh remember, yeah. Remember there's, that's what's work. Yes sir. So, like that screw there. Yep. Same on that. Oh yeah. You are giving us some insight. Okay, you wanted I this video. I am giving insight. You wanted this videotaped here. The your sky is blue. You're videotaped. <laughs> okay, so yes. Oh, well, you're taking the camera even. Oh no. Oh no. Uh -oh. So if you look at the wall, real close, oh, about halfway down, there's a big whoop-de-doo in it. <laughs> so the turnbuckles 
and braces in here is for straightening that out and that's our next job um, after we get some other projects taken care of but these clips here we're going to run a string around the outside of this and that's what's going to help us uh, get our walls plumb and in check so that we can pour mud tomorrow <laughs> truck just pulled up so we're gonna get our stem walls for today Reading off the last little bit of all. Everybody's covered in cement. So the cement truck just left. Dylan and Tyler are finishing up making sure our braces, our walls are going the way we want them to go so that they're straight with the bracing. And I'll give you a give you a look here at how things look. bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I've got time it's clear to see from up here the world seems small we can sit together it's so beautiful 